the IRS has updated its tax guidelines for the year 2023, and there are a few changes you want to be aware of, especially when it comes to planning your retirement. Victoria Lucas spoke with a financial advisor and joins us now in studio to explain what we need to know. Victoria, good morning. Good morning, Devontae and Audrey. So yes, the IRS has made changes that will have an impact on tax brackets, deductions, and retirement contributions. The biggest change, though, is the Social Security increase to 8.9%, the largest cost of living adjustment we've seen in 40 years. You must be at least 62 years old to start claiming Social Security benefits. If you currently claim them, you're about to see a significant increase in your paycheck. Some of you may be wondering when may be the best time to start cashing in. I spoke with financial advisor, CEO and founder of Alloy Wealth Management, Mark Henry, and he says it depends on your situation. If you're retiring soon and don't have too much saved, you'll want to start collecting the day you retire because you'll need the income. If you're still working at the time you qualify for the benefits, you may want to wait because if you make more than a certain dollar amount, you might have to start paying the funds back. Henry says you could be entering into a different tax bracket with this extra income. So what people hate is a big surprise. So what you don't want to do is roll into the next year after 2023, you got this extra money and then find out you owe a big check back to the IRS. So make sure you're taking out enough money from your Social Security based on this new 8.9% increase. It can be tricky trying to figure out your next steps, especially if you're not ready yet. So the best thing to do is to sit down with a true retirement planner or trusted financial advisor to ensure you're making the best financial benefit to you. So we touched on Social Security in terms of retirement greatly, and you may have questions about the 401k contributions as well. So head to our website, WXII12.com, for more information on that. Live in studio, Victoria Lucas, WXII 12 News. Victoria, thank you.